One night, I was having a lucid dream when my guardian showed up. I'm going to visit a new planet I just found, so I won't be available for a while. But since you have a tendency of finding trouble, I will leave my griffin with you for protection until I'm back. He's under your command, but you better not do anything stupid or I'm blocking all your chakras when I return. Blocking what? Hi. I woke up and I had to go to school, but I kept imagining what I could do with a griffin. Maybe I could use to retrieve my magic feather that the dragon stole. So one night, when I had a lucid dream, I was preparing my griffin for my mission when a woman showed up and I couldn't move. I saw you flying. I need a griffin child. I have an important mission. Well, me too. And he's under my command. Griffin, <coughs> attack her. <coughs> Ow. Okay, okay. Who are you? I used to be human like you, and I will soon be human again. But first, I need a griffin. Why? Because this creature can travel through darkness. It can rescue my soulmate or I'll be born alone. You wouldn't understand. I don't get it. I need someone, but he's stuck in a place of illusions without knowing he died. He still thinks he's human. This is our time to be reborn. And if I don't wake him up, he'll miss the train. Do you understand now? Nope. Just let me borrow the griffin, please. Fine, but I'll go with you. So she told the griffin to take us to where the man was sleeping, and he started flying. Seconds later, we were in a very dark place, and there was a lot of people in it. Everyone was drinking, and some people were doing things I shouldn't be seeing at my age. My energy is dropping fast, we need to find him now. I can't see you anymore. I can't descend as much as you can, but I'm around. <laughs> There he is! There was a drunk man at the corner and I knew it was him. It's funny how I just know things in dreams. So I told the griffin to pick him up and get out of the nightmare. Once we left the place, the man was no longer drunk. Why did you rescue me? I don't want to get born. So you knew? Of course I knew. Then why? Because... Because I don't want to hurt you again. Uh... Thank you, child. We'll meet again one day. But when we do, I will no longer remember you. She gave me a clue how to recognize her and then vanished. By the time I'm telling you this story, this was the last time I saw them. It was probably just a dream, but even if it wasn't, they would still be underage today. What's up? Open a door to darkness, you allow darkness to open a door to you. Griffin! <laughs> ah! I woke up, but I wasn't feeling well. By the end of the day, I was already sick. I couldn't even go to school in the next day. I spent days dreaming about shadow creatures chasing me when. Oh no, not you! Griffin, help! Your griffin is a coward. I told you I was gonna burn you. Ah! Am I alive? Mother told me to burn the darkness inside you. Not that you deserve it. So we're friends now? <sighs> I'll never be your friend, human. But I have my duty to this planet. Consider yourself lucky that she likes you. Okay. I'm back. Amazing planet they had. I'm taking the griffin back. Where is he? He ran away. Hmm. You didn't do anything stupid while I was gone, did you? Nope. Good. Ah, uh, here you are. Let's go, griffin. Farewell, human. I wish you peace and light. Fuck. Thanks for watching my video. In the next video, I talk about the day a fairy spoke to me. So make sure you subscribe to my channel to keep me motivated to make new videos. You can also check out other videos I made, which are similar to this one. Don't forget to leave a comment and a like. Thanks, bye!